In this video, we're going to be looking at our weight classes. To do this, we go to System, Localization, Weight Classes. Now, as you can see, there are four weight classes already set up here. These come down with open cart as a standard. And you'll notice here, kilogram is set to one. So this is kind of the default, if you like. It's the default in that everything else would depend on this. The grams, for instance, the ounces and the pounds are basically a conversion of the one kilogram here. So I'm going to insert the unit and I'm going to call this milligram. Now we have to give the weight unit an abbreviation. So we'll just give it the MG. There's a standard for all these weight unit abbreviations. There's a link just to show you those abbreviations. So next we have to uh, put a value in here. And the value here is a conversion of kilograms to milligrams. So we just go out to Google, type in convert kilograms to milligrams. And basically here in the first page of the search, we don't actually have to go to a page. We can just copy from here. Back in here again to our weight class, paste in the value, go up to the right hand side here and click save. Now we can set any one of these to the default, but we will need to go in and manually convert the other ones based on our default. Now we'll just go and look at where these apply in our catalog products, edit this product, go to the data tab, scroll down to the bottom of the page and here we can see the weight class. The weight class here is set to kilograms for this product and we can drop down here and select to change it to any one of our other weight classes. Now to set our default so that this field here is populated with the same weight class every time we insert a product we scroll back up and go to system settings edit our store go to the local tab and down the bottom here weight class is set here to kilograms so if we drop this down and change this to pounds for instance go up to the right hand side click save we go to our catalog products insert the product go to our data tab scroll down and we can see our weight class here is now set to pounds as a default so it just saves us having to change this every time 